In this tutorial, we're going to look at Excel's round function. There's a few different ways that you can use a rounding formula to get data that maybe rounds up or down depending on how you want it to be positioned, how you want to sort it, etc. Uh, it'd be easy, you see in this new, in our personnel database right here, it'd be easy to take this data and kind of cheat with it and simply get rid of a couple of the decimal points. But that doesn't actually fix the problem and you're going to end up with inaccurate data. So we'll take it back to the starting point. And to type in the formula, you start out with the equal sign, as you always do. And the formula is just round. Type that in hit the brackets, then select the cell that you want to choose from. We'll start with uh, H2, comma, and then the number of digits you want to round to. To round so there's no decimal points, we're going to go to zero in the brackets. And as you can see right here, it takes it to 34.0, 48.0, 18.0. Uh, I've already worked on this spreadsheet, which is the reason why it populated all of them. In most cases, or the very first time you do this, it won't do that. It'll just give you the very first cell, and you'll have to take the fill button, drag it down, and now you can see you have 34, 48, 18, 40, etc. Now to change this, simply going to have to go and get the formatting right. Now we can change those decimals, and you can see the round function took 34.30 down to 34, 47.83 up to 48, all the way down the line. It rounded it just like we wanted it to.